All right, in this video, I'm going to talk about how to become a Power Plan Trades follower on Power um, on Power Plan Trades. It's the locked. It's only for a select f a group that I've been building. I've kicked a lot of people out, but uh, I'm starting this up again, Power Plan Trades. But before I talk about how to become a, a special follower on Power Plan Trades, what I want to talk about is what I'm about and give a a few great examples and again this is part of a test how to get inside a power plant trades because I want people to understand what I'm about what's going on and, and then explain some rules of how I want to run uh, power plant trades okay so before I do that let's take a look at the Apple chart now Apple's been something that's been uh, now I posted this on power plant trades okay on on Thursday this is, uh, there it is October the 8th and and this is before the move, of course, right? This is this is documented and posted on uh, Power Plan Trades on that day. Okay, that was in the evening. Now, what I did was I looked at the pa the charts and you know, of course, and but let's read what I said here. It doesn't matter what I did, but let's read what I said. I made a plan, and this is what I actually did. Now, a, a, a lot of day traders I mean, would kill to be able to be this accurate. They'd kill for this kind of technology, you know. But anyways. And, and and there's no limit to what we can do when you have a person who can give you direction like this there's no limit to how many ways to make money in the market so it's it, but it's proof here i mean i i make these great plans and approve it all the time so here here we go <clears throat> apple that's that's we let's uh, see what i said here apple i'm looking for this to make a good move soon Strong support is the 106 area. Now that's what I've been seeing along. A lot of people were bear like a few days ago. I mean, I mean, reading the sentiment on the board, people were bearish. You have a lot of um, tr with traders were calling up with were, were were making all these put call spreads, and they were. I was, in fact, be honest, people. What was I telling my followers? the select few that are in there i was telling them the opposite we were looking for uh this to go higher but this would fail to confirm my numbers right but this is what i posted on thursday so anyways i said that uh, the october 23 112 calls are good to use here as these could gain 600 percent from here if this can break up into the 120 122 area now by the way uh these options started trading around a dollar uh 50 uh on confirmation these October 23, uh, 112. Now they're, they're now they're over. Um, and now they're in the two two. Uh, they had a, a there was a price time of a two two and a half. At some point, but anyways, <clears throat> they made a nice gain. But um, what I'm saying is here. Uh, I then I I post. Um, so I talk about targets. Right? Now I've been talking about these targets, but I'm I'm pretty sure this is where this heads uh, in, into earnings uh, based on the pattern. Um, but at the same time, uh, what I wanted to post was that it should act a certain way, Apple. That you know, if it had pulled back too much, if we, we were to try to confirm that this was an early entry signal, this is I'm looking for this to break above 110.45 to start a position in this code 44B with the spy breaking 200. This should come into favor, plus based on the pattern, plus, plus based on the pattern I'm seeing, looking to add above 11, 111.50, which is what I had, which is what I did as well, as a possible signal that this will take, that, um, possible signal that this will take this to break 115. Now, what I also said, this is what I'm expecting. So we'll see what happens on Monday. As long as this holds above 109 from the entry point, I would hold. Now, I was talking about the 10.45. And then look what I said here. When we break 111.50, this should not want to stay below 111 for long, with 110 being another stop. Now, why am I explaining this in, in this video? Well, I want to show what happened. I described what I looked at just to show you. I described a price action that was necessary to happen for sustaining a move higher in Apple. And lo and behold, people, this is the incredible uh, analysis skills that I have. Lo and behold, what did Apple do that day? And again, this has been this has been a difficult stock. It hasn't been confirming, but it did confirm my numbers. 
And usually when that happens, something powerful happens. And that's what my why I make these plans to prove something. I mean, I haven't seen a thing. I see people scream out numbers, but they don't they don't have any plans. So let's talk about this now. Let's take a look at the Apple chart here. Let's take the 10-minute uh, chart. Okay. And, of course, this is the ninth. Right? We can even use, let's go to a 5-minute chart, because you know what? It, 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 it's easier to see. So, what do we do? Well, within about, right about the 15 minutes, this, this, this was a place to get entered. It was to enter. It then consolidated. And I said, of course, we should never want to hit 109, right? Well, <laughs> you know, stock never wanted to even go there. So that was very bullish right there. Again, my plan's giving you ideas. Say, hey, you know what? It was very clear to stay long. Well, people, oh, it's got to go down. Anyways, I, I read the, you know, I read some comments, stupid comments on the board. And then I said to add at 111.50 uh, that it shouldn't want to go below 111. Well, then I say that. So let, 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 let's go and, and see. Let's go read that point, people. Right. This is important to understand because this is what I'm about, right? And it's incredible what I wrote here. <clears throat> and it's something, you know, it's something for you to understand as well. I says, look at add above. And, and, and when this should not break, oh, what did I say here? I am seeing, look at add one as possible. Now, here, when we break 11.50, this should not want to stay below 111 for long. For long. 110 being another stop area, meaning that if we were to start to trade below 111, right? Now, let's go back to the chart now. This was said before. This is almost like a future forecast. That's how powerful the analysis was. But, you know, it didn't happen perfectly like that. But, but let's see, right? So did we go below 111 that day? No. So what does that tell you? That's telling you it's reinforcing that Apple is on the right track. Because when I looked at the analysis of these charts, and this is before the charts were even being able to update from what I'm looking. This is not the only, this is, I look at a lot of screens, okay? But exactly what I said actually happened that day. Okay. All right, now, so let's go back to uh, the Apple charts. Uh, let's go back to, to, my, uh, to my stream. Okay. Now, another big thing that I did, uh, and I posted this on Power Plant Trades for my special followers, uh, was the SPY chart here. And I want to go over this one. I also made an update of what I thought uh, October the 8th, but we're going to talk about what I said at uh, September the 23rd, because, uh, so, sorry, September the 30th. <clears throat> okay. And because this is big as well. Okay. And I want to explain this. Um, because again, this is what this is what I'm about, right? And, um, and of course, people who want to become special followers are, are, are looking in for, for my advice, and you can take this to help your trading as well. So it's very powerful. And again, I don't see anyone doing anything like this. And these are big; these are strong calls, people. So I'm I, I'm on some nice breakthroughs in my uh, my system. So here we go, people. <clears throat> I said that uh, spy in my Apple and Google updates, I explained how the market seemed like another bear trap action as key stocks failed to break down again while things looked bearish. So I'm not just looking at the spy chart, but I'm also looking at my scans and other stocks and how they act. So there's a lot to this, okay? Uh, many are bearish, and, and exactly, that's exactly how it was. Many were bearish. The board on the, I, I read the sentiment on the boards. Nobody was thinking about this to happen. In fact, I've had people, I, people couldn't even believe that that would happen. But lo and behold, people, I mean, these are, these are, this is, this is analysis, people, okay? Not what these people put, put on the boards. And a, a lot of, a lot of, a, a lot of uh, professional traders can do what I'm doing here. I can tell you this. I can't do it. I've written it down before it was to move with, with, with rules. And it moved very well. When they don't, we, you can tell. And now, and let's look what I wrote here. Because at the time, it's something was not to go wrong. I mean, I'm not the one to, I'm not going to say this has got to happen for sure. We have to abandon plans. But look how well this plan worked. 77D. Many are bearish right now. So, so a short squeeze higher from the price action I am seeing is very possible. However, confirmation is key. Okay. Uh, 
of course, we're going to go into this part here. Spy, on the negative side, the spy needs to break below 188 and base below that point. I don't want to explain this part here, so let me read this. The weaker it seems towards the price point, the odds will favor the bulls. Right? So I'm saying the weaker it has a power to go towards 188, that's another bullish sign. So I'm gain. These are powerful clues. Okay. Plus, we are watching a key stock if it keeps rising instead of falling. And I'm going to talk about that stock as well. That will be another good sign of, this, of a strong bounce. I look at things beyond what you see on the chart. Confirmation is key for real moves. Well, that's exactly what I did, right? So I'm looking at the SPY. And I'm also looking for the SPY to confirm because this is also important. But I also got the ideas from uh, my scans, how I look at stocks and how, how stocks are set up to break down, how stocks are set up to break up. How are, you know, because I can't post everything. So I post, so let's try to post a select best few that are giving us the best odds. Sometimes I'm getting into stuff that I, that I don't have time to post to people. Right? That's something in the future. Okay? But right now I'm just 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 you know uh, demonstrating what I can put out in a planned format and demonstrating the analysis skills um, and plans that give people an edge. Okay? So Let's go to the uh, um, let's go to, and then I go. Let, let's read this part here. So if the spy can break above 192.30 and base above that point, the market is set up to take another run to 200. Right? Well, you know what happened, people. Right? Another good sign is for the spy to break above 192.85 and hold above that point for a strong chance of a run to test 200 again. Some are some of our key stocks could make a strong run higher. Confirmation is key. Yeah. Well, you know, one of one of them being Netflix. Uh, it, it I had a lot of great signals on um, on, uh, on on Netflix, and we're going to talk about that uh, quickly. Even this uh, that was a hard day on uh, on Friday on it, but it worked out very well. I want to look. I want to explain that uh, as well. So let's go to um, now. I'm explaining what I'm about, and then we're, then I'm going to explain about how to become a uh, so stay you know so stay keep uh, following. Um, how to become a power plan trades follower okay um, but let's go to the spy first let's go to the charts here uh, and put up the spy and put a 30 minute chart here okay people so it goes beyond what I what I have in my charts but here's September the 30th okay now October the 2nd when this had a clear and you can see now we've had a strong directional run I mean exactly what I described when we broke key levels exactly what happened you know then we based and I actually uh, people were thinking about shorting the uh, this this uh, this buy <laughs> uh, I was reading that too people and uh, you know of course we broke out higher because in my scans I've seen so much powerful setups you know that you know the odds favored higher prices and so that's the big difference people were really listen to people people were very bearish over here right they were very bearish in this area september 30th uh, very bearish here but i made a plan 192.65 basing right look at this we you know this is a 30 minute chart because it's a way to see it we based we did exactly what again like the apple i mean this is the spy this is the spiders people Show me, show me any professional who's been able to come up with a. This is a written plan before the move. It's not just saying it crosses a number and that's it. And there's, I've given giving reasons, and this is strong analysis, and I captured it with two big, 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 big name. You know, you got here, you got the big, big, difficult markets, right? Apple's been very difficult. Boom, it finally confirmed. On Thursday, again, this is early entry signal. We still got to break up higher, but boom, it was perfectly described what should happen. If it, you know, things don't work out, what do you have to do, people? You have to take a, you have to take a loss. But if we were to look at the spy trade, you, what loss would you take? You would make huge gains, understanding that the bias was to the upside. There was nothing negative against you. You could feel it. You could see it in the charts. There was no sell signal or anything. This market was a bit choppy. Right. In fact, this is easier to trade than the than than trading some some like something like a Netflix. But anyways, that's despite the point. 
power to trade here, baby. <laughs> this is this is analysis, people. This is analysis. 99D. All right. So, how to become a chart witness follower, people? I'm going to talk about the Netflix a little bit after here. How to become a chart witness follower? Well, as a follower, you need to be active in the market. Okay. I need everyone to have a profile pic. It should be of stocks, a picture of yourself, like something to do with stocks, a picture of your stock uh, of yourself, or something of success. You need some sort of a profile pic, and you need to have one for both a Twitter account and a stock twits account. Uh, the same one, okay? Then what you want to do is you want to uh, send me a direct message. Send me a direct message, okay? And you're going to tell me that you want to become a chart witness follower. Send me a message. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, follow you and then send you some questions about this, um, what I've said in this video, okay? To make sure that, you know, you're a serious person, that you're taking the time to listen. Because you know what? I don't want just anybody in power plant trades. I want serious people, okay? And basically, as a follower, you want to make comments, okay? You want to make comments when I post, what, what like especially like anything you witnessed, you want to make comments l like you see here on the Apple chart, right? That's all those special followers, you know, and you want to be regularly doing that. Now, you know, not every, but again, a lot of people, uh, I tell you, um, you know, the market is a constantly fast changing pace thing. So you need to kind of be paying attention on a daily basis. Uh, and I don't, again, no one needs to take the trades here. But if you're a chart witness follower, you want to be following along, seeing what I'm saying, seeing how things play out, right? And then you want to make comments on it, whether you got in the trade or not, or if you did. Some people, you know, people get in and they're really happy. I've had people really give me some uh, great feedback. But there's a lot of lazy people, uh, people. You know, a lot of re the reason why people lose in the market is because they're lazy. They don't study. They just think that they're going to follow somebody and just make money. You know, I have rules... And these rules actually teach you something and actually show you something and they give you an edge. And you can look at the charts for yourself to decide what you want to do, right? It's up to you, right? But I am kind of giving you my, showing you my plans and my, 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 my strategies uh, as a helping aid to help you, uh, you know, make more money and showing a, a, straight, a strategy. So anyways, um, so basically you want to make comments. Regular followers make comments. Super followers share charts. And then inside of power plant trades there's a video that explains how to share charts and sh check that out when you get inside the power plant trades now on twitter by the way people what people do on twitter is you um i don't want to go to this one let's um uh, oh yes yeah, on twitter basically you make retweets and favorites okay so retweets favor so you hit the retweet button i don't know if this one it won't open Basically, the retweet button allows you to, to add a, a comment, and then you hit the retweet. And then what you do is it retweets the, the chart. Because Power Trigger, what, whatever I post on Power Trigger Trade, on, on for me anyways, that's how it works. Whatever I post on, you can make set it up for yourself too. Whatever I post on Power Trigger Trade uh, on, on, um, on Twitter goes automatically, uh, sorry, on um, Stock Twits goes automatically to the Twitter. Okay, and so all you want to do, and again, become because you're a follower, you want to be active on a daily basis. So you should be able to make some sort of a comment, especially when I post something. You know, you try to do it on a daily basis. It takes about 30 seconds to do this stuff, you know, making retweets, hitting the favorite button, on, especially on stuff you witnessed and uh, that you liked. You want to kind of be always active, right? And that's what I'm looking for. If you're not able to be active, um, you know, just don't message me. Um, you know, don't become a follower. Just, you know, follow what I'm doing here. You know, you're going to see the after stuff, like like this Apple trade, in order to see it or maybe even want to participate in it, for example. You would need to be a follower in order to see it. But what I'm going to do is post on Power... Uh, and sometimes I post stuff on Power Trigger Trade as well. But right now, what I want to do is kind of focus on power plant trades because I've done that a lot of free posting um, and it's free to go into by the way it's free to go into power plant trades right but what it is, is I'm looking for select followers that are going to do these th simple things you know uh, that are, are, are witnesses and they're making they're, they're really following what what's going on 
and and witnessing what I'm doing here. These plants, right? Because these are great. And you know, a lot of people, you know, they may 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 they may look at something but not really pay attention and and not realize the power that they're that they're missing up here. I mean, you know, just take a look at some of the this my Netflix plan uh, that I posted that worked out very well. Um, and this was posted. Uh, this was a little, this was a little tricky, but it worked the second time because what happened was they had pulled down the, the spies. But if we look at this, this, these are plants. I talk about volume. Okay, and um, if you go take let's go take a look quickly at the Netflix chart. So basically, that's what you want to do as a follower. I'm gonna to go to Netflix here. As a follower, so what happened was we did get the volume. It did confirm, but they had pulled us back. I had to get out at, at, at you know at a break even, and then the the stock pop. pop um, pop back up it consolidated and then try to go and boom like I explained uh, I mean you need we need to look at a shorter time frame to really see this even a five minute um, really shows it a lot better so you had the pullback October the 8th then the explodes explodes back up to the area consolidation and then rising higher so if you had to take the second trade on that um, you would have done really well uh, it, it usually doesn't work that way. Usually what happens is when they confirm, that was an unusual thing that happened with them. Um, uh, that was difficult. So you had to take the second one. If you didn't, well, then you would have missed the move, right? <clears throat> and again, nobody needs to take things, but you're witnessing these plans, and they do work out. They do work out very well most of the time, right? Not everything can work, right? That's why, actually, that's why we have these confirmation rules. Sometimes we skip it. We don't get it. Just because I post something as a buy, that I think it's going to go up, doesn't mean that it's going to go up, right? It has to confirm. That's another thing, important point I wanted to mention. Everything that you see that I, I explained about the spy and the apple, it confirmed. So there you have it, people. You know, thanks for listening. Like the video.